I know we're told never to judge a book by its cover, but that's exactly what we're going to do here today. Now, we're not actually going to do any book reviews or anything like that, but for film or for movies that are going to be coming out, the best thing to cover that we have are the trailers. So how many times have you been scrolling through the internet and you find a trailer, you start watching it, and you're like, oh, okay, that looks good. Well, that's kind of exactly what we're going to do. We're going to be judging some of these movies uh, based on their trailers. I'm not going to do like the very big movies such as like Black Panther or Infinity Wars. Why? One, there's probably about a million trailers that are going to, that are going to be coming out for these things and... I mean, they're, they're just too popular. So instead, what I'd like to do is maybe introduce you guys to films that you're not going to be seeing on TV spots or during the Super Bowl or something like that. Something that you may have to dig a little bit for. I'll be putting links into the, into the movies that we talk about, you know, in the description below. But, so let's get into it. So today I wanted to kind of talk about uh, something that not a lot of guys do talk about, which is rom-coms. Um... So I picked two films, uh, one called The Boy Downstairs and the other called Are We Not Cats? So I started watching the trailer for The Boy Downstairs and almost immediately I'm like, okay, this is going to follow the same pattern as pretty much everything else, you know? Something happens, one of the one of the couple is trying to find themselves and then fate kind of throws them into the same place. So what's happening in this one is basically she, the, uh, the main, the main lady, her name is, uh, Zosia Mamet. I think that's how you pronounce it. I could be completely wrong on that, but basically she breaks up with some guy. That's not a part of the story of the first breakup, but basically she's moves into this apartment trying to kind of restart her life. And it turns out her ex-boyfriend lives at the apartment downstairs and, oh, you live here? Oh, and then of course all kinds of like awkwardness ensues and I mean throughout the trailer I mean gosh they, they pretty much give you the whole plot um, so it comes up that oh maybe he still has feelings for her oh maybe she still has feelings for him and blah 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 yeah it's supposed to be funny and heartfelt and you know all the things that all the other magazines or you know movie review people are supposed to say about movies that are coming out but I don't know, I've seen that storyline so many times that I'm just kind of like, okay, I kind of know what's going to happen here. Um, and again, I could be judging this book by its cover too much, and it might completely throw me for a loop, but after that, watch, but after watching that trailer, okay. not. I mean, I'm not dying to go see it. If it was on TBS or something like that, I might watch it. I might leave it on the channel. Maybe if it's on Redbox and I'm kind of bored, okay, maybe I'll pick it up, but not too interested in that one. Now, with that said, we move on to the second film we were going to talk about. Are We Not Cats? This looks a little interesting weird. So, <laughs> starts off with a guy who looks like he's either near homeless or just flat out homeless. And he's clearly looking for a job. He's knocking on some, some guy's door and he's like... I heard you were looking for a driver and he's like yes do you have a car blah 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 and so he's got he doesn't have a car he has a big box truck and he goes to pick this guy up but of course he's a little the the main guy he's a little disheveled and and he picks this guy up and I guess he takes him to some kind of like rave party in the middle of the night in some sketchy part of town he meets a girl there and I don't know, they end up not sleeping together, but all three of them, the guy he picked up, this girl, and the main guy, they end up sleeping in the back of his box truck, which I think he was living out of, and so in the morning, she invites him to come hang out with them again. And then, um, craziness just goes everywhere. All of a sudden, she's talking about feeling sick, she's lifting up a wig, and at first I was like, oh, okay, maybe she has cancer, oh, that sucks, but I don't think that's the case. She looks really weird. I don't know what it is. Um, and then there's a scene where he's like scratching his back because it looks like he's got some kind of like rash breakout. And man, it just looks so, so crazy. Uh, so I'm, I'm a little interested to see this one. Um, and that's and that's what I'm talking about because it is a romance film. I don't know where it's going to go. I don't know who, the, I mean, is it him and the girl? I mean, it, it kind of alludes to that fact that it's going to be the main guy living in the box truck and this girl that he meets at the party. 
But uh, I don't know. I think it could go either way. I, I think there could be all kinds of weird stuff that happens. And the cool part about it is this differing from like the other formulaic movie, like The Boy Downstairs. I don't know what's going to happen with the main characters. I don't know if they're going to actually end up together or if there's going to be some kind of drama and somebody dies or if things are just going to turn out weird. I, I don't know. So, uh, the boy downstairs, <laughs> are we not cats? Okay. Okay. So, uh, yeah, that's my, those are my two covers that I would be judging today. If you know, if you, uh, you let me know if there's any movies that you guys are thinking about where you've watched the trailer and you're kind of like, uh, I don't know if I'm going to see this. I'd love to hear about it. But until the next time, guys, have a good one. So if you like that video and want to hear more, uh, please do me a favor, hit the like button below. I'm, I'm looking forward to making a, a slew of different um, different genres. We're talking about romance, foreign, action, comedy. You know, I want to encompass everything here. So yeah, hit the like button and subscribe.